So in this video, I'm going to show you guys how you can create comic books with the help of Chat GPT and Midjourney with the trick to get the consistent style in all of your generations. So I'm going to show you the complete process of how you can create your comic book stories with the help of Chat GPT and manifest or picture those stories using Midjourney and create amazing comic titles for your comic books. So yeah, let's just go ahead and explore that and see how it's done. All right, guys. So for creating comic comic book title pages uh, with the help of chat gpt and mid journey right over here so we have very simple steps first of all i went to chat gpt so i'm using chat gpt uh for like which is chat gpt plus versions so if you don't have that uh, you don't need to worry you can use a 3.5 one that will work absolutely fine for your this purpose as well all right so first of all, I type in a prompt like create 10 titles for a retro futuristic comic book. So this is basically uh, the title of the comic book that I'm looking for and that I want to create with the help of my journey, all right? So ChatGPT basically provided me with the 10 titles, uh, like the 10 recommended titles that I can go ahead and choose from. So yeah, after that, I really much like the first one, Neon Skies and Robotic Lies. So I went ahead and typed in my prompt once again that I like the title Neon Skies and Robotic Likes and then I said please tell me what's this story about, okay? So ChatGPT basically provided me the full comic book story which includes setting, plot and in plot we have basically seven different types of act, alright? So you can go ahead and study like what this is all about. So this is a, about a main character named Max, which is a writer, a young and talented hacker with a pension for uncovering the truth. Then the act two is the escape, then the revolution, then the resolution, okay? So these are basically the themes for that. And then after that, you can go ahead and ask Chad GPT itself that I provided a very simple, straightforward problem, all right? So I said, now give me the parts in the way so that I can use these prompts for AI image generation of my comic book and create comic book in mid-journey, all right? And I also tried mentioning in every prompt that this is about comic book and also whether it's an opening shot, etc. Because you guys know, like, yeah, in mid-journey, you have to be very specific, right? You need to provide, like, uh, this, this, this prompt. I'm looking for a comic book and whether it's an opening shot. So for that, mid-journey is going to provide you the exact output, okay? So I specifically typed these things in my prompt, okay? So then, ChatGPT went ahead and provided me uh, the images for my seven different scenes, all right? So these are literally the prompts right over here. So first of all, we have opening shot for a retro futuristic comic book, uh, Neon Skies and Robotic Lines. So we have, first of all, the title of our opening shot. Then we have for the interior scene, then for the pivotal scene, and then all the other images. So we have now a total of seven images that we can go ahead and create comic book uh, for our title uh, which was basically neon skies and robotic lies right all right so now exactly our mid journey is going to come into act so i went ahead and go to the mid journey and i basically type all of these prompts right over here in my mid journey so this is my first prompt you guys can see so this is my second prompt right over here so then we have my third prompt you guys can see then the fourth and then the fifth and the sixth and seventh right so these are all my seven prompts that I provided to Midjourney, I simply copy pasted into that, right? And another important thing, you need to make sure that you select your aspect ratio as two by three, right? This is really important because you guys know uh, the comic books, they come in as like two by three aspect ratio, like these kind of aspect ratios, right? Because they are in portrait in like vertical mode. So after a uh, mid journey is done with all of the creations, you guys can see, obviously, if you guys know Midjourney provides you four variations uh, for your every prompt. So this is the image for my first one, which was the opening shot for a retro futuristic comic book uh, bathed in vibrant neon lights. So this looks really, really good. Then we have the second scene, which was basically about, you know, Max scene writer, a young determined hacker in a glitter workshop. So yeah, for that, this looks really, really good. And then we have the third scene, which was basically, you know, like a humanoid robot with expressive eyes, right? So yeah, this looks really, really good. Then we have the fourth scene where human and robot resistance members strategize. All right. Then we have the fifth, sixth, and seventh. So now from here, we're going to go ahead and upscale your favorite variation from each of your comic book, all right? So this is basically the image for my first scene. This is going to be for my second scene. Then I have for the third scene right over here. Then the fourth, then the fifth, 
and the sixth and lastly our seven scene right over here right so i'm gonna go ahead and just simply download each of this one by one all right guys so after you're done with the downloading you need to come into canva.com go to your templates and search comic strips so after that you simply need to browse through uh, different templates that canva.com is going to offer you uh, so you're going to choose your favorite one from that come into your uploads and just simply upload all your comic book images right over here all right and after that one by one you simply need to go ahead and just tweak with your settings paste your comic book images right over here play around with the fonts with the uh, different comic book icons uh, and also, uh, you know, the captions, which are basically really important in comic books. And after that, you can simply uh, go ahead and play around with the instructions as well. You can type in your story into that. Again, uh, you can play around with the classic icons uh, that are there in the comic books. So you can tweak uh, through that according to your settings and make your comic book more and more engaging, like as per your creativity, right? So this is how uh, you will be able to uh, like shape your images that you created from mid journey into a proper comic book you can type uh, you know anything in the instructions you can write your story that chat gpt created for you and make the perfect comic book that you desire all right all right so there you go guys this was the exploration of how you can go ahead and create comic book theme titles uh, with the help of chat gpt and mid journey so yeah i really wish this video was helpful to you guys and I hope to see you soon in the next mid-journey video. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.